Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check which devices are connected to your Google account. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, I have my iPhone here. I'm just going to open up a web browser. You can open up a web browser on your iPhone, Android computer. It doesn't matter which one. We're going to log into your Google account here. And first, we're just going to type in my account dot google dot com so right there my account dot google dot com and hit go if you're not already logged in it will prompt you to log into your account that you want to check those devices the connected devices on now that we're already logged in at the very top you can see personal info data let's scroll over and tap on security and then you'll see recent security activity here, various sign-ins. You can see recovery phones and emails, as well as your devices. So let's hit this manage all devices. This will show every single connected phone, tablet, computer to this account. So you can see seven sessions on iPhone and the top one that is me, obviously, this is this iPhone. So you can see from 11 minutes ago all the way back to December of 2023. And then another 11 sessions on a Mac computer. This is my Mac computer as recent as 18 minutes ago. And I can scroll all the way back down to January 31st. Now on any of these, if you don't necessarily recognize that specific device, you can just tap on it. And it'll give you a bit more information, the location of it, what it was using, various apps, maybe Safari, Google Chrome services, stuff like that. Now you can choose, you can hit this sign out button and it will automatically sign that specific device out of your account. And then of course you can hit this don't recognize something and that will help to protect your account. Now, if you go through that process and you find a device that you don't recognize, I would recommend basically scrolling down here and tapping on password. And then from here, you're going to enter in this face ID or confirm that you own this account. And then you're just going to want to enter in a new password. By doing so, it will kick every other device off and prompt them to sign in with the new password before they're able to connect and use your specific account. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.